Greetings, sirs and madams. I'm Strafik Zero, and we're playing Gundam Battle Operation 2. So here we have a match with the Kubli, and yes, I know this thing is horribly broken, <laughs> but uh, yeah, hopefully we have an interesting match here. So yeah, we're playing a 650 ace match, and yeah, the thing that's interesting about this match is, you know, we're on the, the desert map, and the thing about the Kubli is it's very, very good at mid to close range, or mostly mid range, but um, the desert map, it's this is basically um, a map that allows for super long range battles, so uh, that's actually what's going to be challenging about this match is the enemy team, they're going to be... Uh, they're going to be fighting us from long range mostly, so this is going to be actually a pretty big challenge for the Kubli, because a lot of its weapons don't reach that far. So, yeah, so I went ahead and captured that spawn point like I always do. Uh, yeah, we're fighting over the hill. Okay, destroyed uh, the enemy Kubli. Okay, let's see. Uh, not too many targets close by. Okay. We're going to counter on that Zeta, so we just... You know, focus fire on him to do as much damage as we could. He seems to have a stacked beam defense because I wasn't doing very much damage to him at all. Okay, yeah, I am, uh, uh to be honest, like, I'm not a very good shot with the beam gun <laughs> on the Kubli because I'm not really used to, like, uh, like, slidey type dom movements and then, uh, you know, the, the, the beam gun, it's, I don't know why, but it's it's uh, round velocity. It doesn't seem to be as high as other beam weapons, but I don't know. That's probably just me. Okay, so we have a few suits uh, here in uh, in mid range, like uh, so that Kubli just use its dodge roll. So yeah, we can probably probably get in close if you wanted to. Okay, got in a killing shot on that Zeta. Okay, I don't know what's with this Kubli uh, on my right. I was trying to bait out a tackle or, or something like that, but he didn't go for it. Okay, there we go, he used his roll, so... Yeah, there's your classic Kubli combo. Like, <laughs> I'm not going to be able to uh, do that uh, so often in this match, because, you know, everybody's kind of... Like, just kind of shooting at each other from a distance. Okay, here's an Alex, a bit of a rarity at this cost. Yeah, I guess... <clears throat> yeah, this was uh, from a while back. Uh, we didn't have uh, the Tristan yet, so I... Ideally, he'd be using a Tristan instead. Oh, that is uh, pretty weird. Yeah, I don't know why that, that Jaeger came up close. Oh, he's in a lot of trouble. <laughs> uh, very outnumbered. Okay, smart move. Somebody is shooting at me from behind. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I was just um, trying to use my neutral to stunlock this guy. There we go. Yeah, we have a, a Beam Bazooka GPO2 on our team. Um, yeah, I tried to use that like the other day, like yesterday. Uh, they're um, they're tough to use at this cost range. They're they're, they're a bit slow. Um, okay, so the enemy team is spawning back in from points B and D. Yeah, we yeah we don't exactly have enough um, covering fire to close distance on them. So the Zeta's coming in. Ah, yeah, I was planning on down swinging him as he was flying, but yeah. Yeah, he kind of flew past me. Okay, get in some shots. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting um, the funnels can stun. Yeah, that's a that's kind of a nice trick to get around biosensor. So yeah, when a Zeta activates biosensor, like the the stun or the the, the trip doesn't count. But if you activate biosensor with a neutral and follow <laughs> into your downswing, uh, you can just kind of ignore it. So yeah, that worked out pretty okay. Alright, so yeah, I was really low on health, uh, spawned back in. I have, um... Yeah, I have a really bad habit of, like, hitting the ground, like, in the desert. I think it's because, uh... It's just from, like, using cannons a lot. Like, I aim for people's feet. So it kind of causes me to deviate low a lot of times. Okay, that Zeta's almost dead. I'm gonna leave him alone for, uh, the ace to come in. Oh, shit. Shot me. Okay, my... Oh no, <laughs> that didn't work at all. Who the hell? I did not expect that. We're gonna roll out of the way. Thank God for a double dodge roll. God damn it. Um, yeah, <laughs> I uh, I really don't like being ace. 
But uh, at least, thankfully, the, the Kubli is, is a very good ace mold suit. Alright, there I go uh, aiming low again. Oh shit, that is very weird. Yeah, they gotta do something about landing and recovery in this game. It freaking sucks. God, it feels almost as bad as uh, the Gundam Versus games. Like, the landing and recovery in that game is basically the only openings you have to do damage. Alright, well, yeah, I was, I was pretty much expecting that death. Okay, yeah, that was a uh, pretty bad timing on me being assigned as ace. Yeah, and, uh, yeah, so, yeah, the follow funnels are probably the best for just, like, finishing people off. Yeah, that was pretty easy. Yeah, and their ace is isolated right now, but it'd probably be foolish to run off after him by myself. Okay, let's see what the team's doing. This guy's pretty hurt. Okay, yeah, we basically have him separated from his team right now, so, yeah, primary good target. Okay, my uh, downswing didn't count for some weird reason. Oh, no. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, yeah, that really sucks. Oh, who did that? Yeah, I, I could have got that guy pretty easy, but... And Zeta's leaving. Flanked by this Kubli, so I'm just gonna probably back off a little bit. I'm doing pretty good damage to that Kubli. Okay, their ace... Um, I guess he's trying to reposition, but he really exposed himself by moving that far away from his team. Oh, whoops. <laughs> yeah, I really didn't need to do that tackle, but um, I was anticipating that Zeta coming in to melee me. Okay, let's back up a bit. Yeah, I could use uh, the back funnels. They do have a little bit more range, but honestly, I, I don't like setting up for them. They, they kind of take a while. Oh shit, did I just get a double kill? <laughs> yeah, I killed the Zeta just as I died. Um, yeah, transforming like leaves you really open. Yeah, that was stupid. <laughs> Alright, well, uh, we're coming up to the end of the match. I don't have enough time to spawn back in, but um, yeah, it looks like my, my team did pretty good. So let's look at the score here. Okay, so we took the match. Uh, I've never seen a green MLRS before. Okay, so we have about a 7,000 point lead. Uh, the enemy team was didn't have any melee types, so I, I didn't really have any prime targets. But yeah, it looks like our other Kub lead did all the work, and I just took all the credit. <laughs> I'm quite good at that, apparently. Uh, so yeah, um, yeah, I don't know. We have similar team makeups uh, with tech, and my team technically has type disadvantage. But uh, but yeah, that match was pretty weird. Um, yeah, I'm not really sure why we won, just maybe better teamwork or something, but anyway guys, uh, that's going to be it for that match, hopefully you enjoyed it, and we'll see you next time.